What's up blockheads? Out here today we're going to be working on the Tacoma and in today's video we are just doing a small lighting modification but this lighting modification uh, basically takes away some of the chrome which you know we're going for that blacked out you know very minimal look indicators here. So yeah these pieces right here we got an apart from Meso Customs that basically replaces that. So these are the Meso Customs 2016 and up Tacoma Ultimate Turn Signals. That's what we're gonna be installing this episode, so let's get to it. Sorry if there's any road noise, I am right by the road working in the Harley Davidson parking lot. All right, so this is uh, me unboxing it. You've got a sticker. Looks like you've got an invoice and then we've got the actual smoked blacked out signals. There you go. So yeah, that's what we're going to be replacing. Now, these uh, are much brighter and they're uh, they're smoked instead of being chrome. Man, these are, these are really quality stuff. Good job, Meso Customs sure if you guys are frequent members of Tacoma World Forums, you know that stuff from Meso is usually kind of hard to get. But I know they made a big batch of these, so uh, they were available for quite a while. Not sure if they're still available, but I know they're working on the uh, V5s right now. So basically, these are only going to be indicators. Uh, the next ones, the V5s, are going to be indicators. They're also going to have uh, DRLs, so you can either do an amber DRL or a white DRL plus uh, I think it's a sequential turn. So I'll show you guys what the current uh, signals on the mirrors look like, and then we'll compare it to these. We'll do like a side by side. All right, just so you guys can see, this is what it looks like beforehand. Can't even hardly see them from the front. Turtle. All right, so to get these off, what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna pull on this upper ledge and then inwards. So basically start here and you're gonna pull it off this way. Now, a couple people do recommend the plastic bag method, in which case there's a plastic bag that comes with the Meso stuff. So whenever this pops off, a lot of people don't have a good grip on it because these, you know, these move. But what a lot of people do is drop them. So bag method, put the bag over and you start pulling from here. Right, but this is gonna go like that. So you're gonna have to put some pressure here. So that basically keeps it from popping off. And you can see we've got it loosened and off of that lip right there. There you go. Set that off to the side. All right, so here you've got the inside of the mirror. You're gonna have uh, two Phillips screws. So we're gonna undo those real quick. All right, what that's gonna do Gonna loosen this up right and then down in here you've got a little harness piece that that plugs into we're gonna want to disconnect that you're gonna want to pinch this piece here so it releases so you're basically just gonna kind of grab this piece pull outwards there you go you've got the indicator removed we're just gonna undo that This is the left side. We're going to get the same left side indicator on the new one, which is going to be that one there. Just gonna plug this one in. All right, so we've got it all basically plugged back up, fitted back in. Pay special attention to this little piece right in here. I'll post a picture of it. Make sure that that basically like fits in. You're gonna, you know, put your thumb here, grab this piece and squish them together. So you hear it snap in and then it's pretty much in there. We've got the wires rerouted, all plugged back in. So at this point, before I put this other cover back on, I'm gonna turn the truck back on and uh, we'll turn these lights back on just to make sure they work. Yeah, there you go, it works. And it is so much brighter than the original. So next up, reinstall wise, we're gonna put the Phillips screws back into here. There you go, and everything pops back on. That looks a lot better. 
So here's a little back and forth of a before and after. And here's a back and forth of a before and after with the lights. Much more visible. So we're just gonna repeat the same thing on the other side. Easy stuff. That one works too. Good to go. So they are much brighter. And then since they're smoked, they really add to the look of the truck. They look good. I like them. And you can see them, they're much more visible. I'll have to do some like night shots with them just so you guys can see if that as well. So let's go to the parking garage and I'll get some footage there just so it's a little darker. All right, there we go. Anyways, that's them much brighter much more visible from actually all angles you couldn't really see the last ones in the front of the car but now you can that's a huge difference and when we look at them off we don't have that chrome strip anymore and it's just dark that's great love it Good job, Meso. If you guys are interested in these, check out the link down in the description below. Anyways, guys, there you go. That is the install video. I hope it helped some of y'all. You know, a lot of mention of the bag trick and all that stuff, but yep, I'll post it up and uh, hopefully a lot of you guys find it useful. If you guys have any questions, be sure to drop a comment down in the comment section below and I will try to answer to the best of my knowledge. Once again, good job, Meso Customs. I'm not being paid for this. I didn't get the products for free or anything like that. It's just a quality product. So you guys be sure to uh, support a uh, you know a good business that makes quality stuff. Trucks coming along. If you guys can see on the inside, I got some SCS F5 wheels. Getting tires on them today, and uh, yeah, it's coming along. So that'll be wheels, tires, and I got a lift coming in from Tacoma Beast. Tacoma Beast is working with me in the build, so that'll be some content that's incoming. And uh, yeah, we got a lot more to go. So, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. If you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button as well. Hit that bell icon also, so it sends you notifications of future uploads and activity. So next time you guys drive safe out there, stay vigilant, stay bright with some Meso Ultimate indicators. <laughs> I'll catch you guys on the next one. Deuces.